it feels really amazing, <laughs> surreal at, at the same time because um, I, with the nomination, it was it was quite a big thing to actually be nominated, let alone win it. So, um, but but the process of the whole month of everyone cheering on from the squash community, but and mostly in Malaysia, my family, my friends, all all sharing with their peers in their WhatsApp group, saying you know continue voting because Nicole deserves this spot. So it's been such a like overwhelming experience to see so much coming uh, love coming back from everybody and especially after like yesterday getting the I mean also getting the news it was really <laughs> uh it was just news all over Malaysia and everybody has been congratulating me and I, I'm truly uh touched and heart, uh, have my heart felt for all the the gracious um uh, words and encouragement and also the praises that I've gotten from all over the world. I got all my friends and everybody uh, messaging me but also like my social media everybody's posting something on their their stories and just congratulating me sending some lovely um, wishes and saying great things so um, I mean, it, even the the king in Malaysia and the prime minister had sent their wishes on their pages. So it was huge, huge, huge for me to get this recognition from the country and and everybody supporting me and cheering me on from from afar. The voting system was, uh, I think, it was just there, but I know for a fact that the people close to me kept reminding me that oh, you are at this stage now and you are having a good lead and. We'll continue voting to make sure you win it. And in my family, everyone's like keeping me posted on what's happening, uh, hoping to see me get through it. So I didn't, I didn't fully like take notice, but I think I was getting some reminders each day, just to have that um, sense of pride from the country to know that they have something to to support or to be uh, voting for. And I got that from the, the amount of votes that I ended um, having is it, it just it's just a testament to how much people have just put their heart and soul to to really make this happen for me. So I really thank them with all with from the bottom of my heart uh, all goes goes back to them. In different ways it has its special um, recognition. So from the squash um, side, from PSA, recognizing me as the greatest squash player of all time is, is um, a special place for me in my heart. But uh, recognize, being recognized as the greatest athlete of all time with different sports, all non-Olympic sports around the world is, is quite a, a feat as well to, to have that recognition in place. So I think there's two things in this is this uh, matter but to have both <laughs> it's quite it's quite a special um place to be with this uh, award i hope that uh, squash would get uh, more recognition uh, within the, the sporting arena not just um in asia but also globally and also with the big um big organizations that are up there looking at squash to see what what they can um do to include uh, the sport in the gate in the Olympic Games one day, or who knows? Maybe we encourage more Asians, uh, Asian squash players to participate in the sport. Malaysians, are, of course, to keep keep striving further to do good things in the the, the squash scene. Um, but yeah, just to create that awareness, I think it's it's a such a privilege to be playing squash, and I know what it's done for me for my life and. I hope someday that with this with this recognition and this award, uh, that the sport can get its name out there in the global scene and also in Asia too. It's truly special for uh, coming uh, from all the um, squash players, the pro players that are on tour, all like from the juniors, from our Malaysian squash players, all of them have been. Um, supporting me and saying some amazing things about what I've, I've done to contribute to the sport and I think all this is just really uh, shows how how special our sport is and the, the the athletes that are involved the female players the and the male players the 
the juniors, the community, they all come together as one when we, they want to cheer on uh, their sport, their squash uh, fans, uh, their squash top player or whatever it is, they want to see them do well. So I think that from the squash community side, I like to thank all the players who have like supported me and said those um, lovely words and, and encouragement uh, from all the squash organizations as well, from World Squash, PSA, every, and also back home, SRAM and the Penang State uh, Squash Association. Everybody has been has played a part in my squash journey. The World Games is something pretty special for um, the squash players because a lot of a lot of the squash players um, don't get don't get a chance to play in. Um, I mean, all like the, the some squash players around the world don't get a chance to play multi-sport games, and I feel that uh, that the one in well in Colombia was great in Cali. I had to play Natalie Grinham, um in the finals and. And that was uh, quite a, a tough one, but I, the, the atmosphere was great. It was my first time in Colombia and I had a, a blast with the crowd. It's, it felt like a little fiesta going on around the, the scene. So I was very, I think that was quite, quite a special one. I, I'm fortunate I get to compete in the Asian Games and the Commonwealth Games, but in the World Games, it's the whole, the whole globe. So you have all our top players actually playing the, uh, the World Games, and it's also recon um, recognized for sports that are not in the Olympic Games. So they make it count. So we, so during those um, medal wins, the gold medal wins in um, all my World Games, it's, it was very such a treat. And you also you're there representing your country, and you're raising the flag any way possible to gain a medal. So that that brings another sense of pride that you are doing something not just for the sport but also for your country at the same time it's a lot of fun especially i really like playing those multi-game sports and get to watch other sports too <laughs>